Hello, and welcome to this quick demonstration of how to set up permalinks in a blog. I have uh, in front of me a new website that I'm setting up called createagooglewebsite.com. And what I wanted to do was just give a quick demonstration uh, as to how to set the permalinks up. What happens when you have permalinks in a blog, they are basically the permanent links that you that will be a part of your blog as long as you have the blog unless you decide you want to change it down the line which makes it difficult when if you if you did decide to do that uh, it's not necessarily a good idea to change your permalinks so bef so you don't have to change them or so you won't have to change them the best thing to do is to set them up in the beginning so that you can compete with uh, search engines when you blog so they give you the common settings which are default day and name, month and name, numeric, and then you get a, an option for the custom sh structure. I always use the custom structure because when I blog out, I don't want to have one, two, three, or a number at the end of my post because I want the search engines to be able to see those keywords that uh, I blog out. And let's say the keywords are website traffic. So at the end of this, I actually want this to say website traffic not p123 or not year day month uh, or vice versa and then a sample post and I wouldn't want it to say this either which looks very similar doesn't it yeah that's very it's just they just reversed it here looks like um, and then the same here, I wouldn't want archives and one, two, three. So I always use the custom structure here. So just click on the custom structure and then you would paste in this code right here. It's slash percentage post name percentage slash. And that's all you need to get your post to actually have a the keyword at the end of your post like for instance in this situation it would be create a Google website and then you would see a slash website traffic and that would be your post so the search engines would see that and go oh this post is about website traffic and that's basically what you want to do with all of your blogs that you have set up and I'll, I'll go into uh, a lot of the other things that you see here blog wise uh, in the future. But for now, just make sure that you have your custom structure set up for your permalinks so when you blog out you can compete with uh, keywords. And then also you want to make sure that you scroll down uh, to the bottom and save the changes here. So once you save these changes, um, that is extremely important because if you don't save those changes it'll go back it'll probably go back to this default or if you have this clicked this is going to be blank and your permalinks won't work the way they should so keep that in mind when you're setting up your permalinks you always want to be able to compete with um, keywords and in search engines so that's the lesson for permalinks and the next time we'll cover another subject in a blog that will help you to um, set up your blog the right way Thanks for stopping by.